in C-Hot, event reservations offer many useful features to make it easier for you to plan and organize any sort of function. For example, you can book multiple rooms for an event by using a function called Plan Rooms. You can also easily create and link accommodation bookings. As for handy tools, there is the daily view and the room list. Last but not least, the rate information offers a breakdown of the charges. To book multiple rooms or locations for one event, use the Plan Room function in the function pane. Seahot now opens the event track. Here you can find out exactly which rooms or locations are available and also which rooms are already reserved for the function. To get a closer look at the availability, change the intervals on the plan. Use the arrows at the top of the plan to navigate to the dates and times you want to see. To add other rooms to the reservation, highlight the room and the requested time period on the rack. This room is immediately added to the list box of new room reservations at the bottom of the screen. Let's add another room. We have now blocked two new rooms. You can directly change the default settings. You can keep adding, changing and removing rooms. When you're finished, click Create to actually take them over into the event reservation. Back in the reservation dialog, the two new rooms are included in the event tree. You can now go into further detail. For example, specifying the purpose of the room, entering the number of guests, or applying rental charges. When you link the event with an accommodation booking, you see basic information in either object and you can directly access the other one, without having to search for it. To add an accommodation booking to an event reservation, click here. Seahot opens the window for an express reservation. The client is already entered. By default, the arrival and departure dates coincide with the event dates. These dates can of course be adjusted as required. Continue entering other basic details of the accommodation booking. Also by default, the number of rooms is the same as the number of guests in the event. Now click New to save the reservation. As you can see, the accommodation booking is immediately included in the event tree. Double click on this branch. And you can call up the reservation directly without having to search for it. All details regarding the accommodation for the participants are handled in the reservation dialog. Let's for example enter a name on the rooming list and go back to our event reservation. If you open the accommodation branch now, you'll see the names of the guests and their exact dates of stay. The daily view of the event tree and the room list are useful tools when planning and organizing complex events. In the summary, the event tree is sorted by function rooms and locations. Let's open the tab called Daily View. Here you can see what the client has booked for each day of the event. You can now work on specific rooms with their service and equipment bookings. The room list, on the other hand, gives you a list box where you can amend details of several function rooms at the same time. Use the rate information if you need an overview of all charges for this function. There are two ways to call it up. First, click on the tab by the same name. Here you can see the total charges per day, for a quick reference. For more details, click the button next to the list box. In this listing, the charges are broken down into different categories. Which service is listed in which column? depends on the definition in the services master file. Alternatively, you can also call up the rate information in the function pane. 